I'm back. We are still on the back of page 12 of the unit three packet. We're gonna finish this page. Uh, so we left off on the seventh reaction. The seventh reaction was sodium plus bromine going to sodium bromide. We're gonna balance and type that reaction. First up, let's type it. And again, typing was done in that first video about the PowerPoint. A plus B makes AB. That is a synthesis reaction. That's half the battle right there. To balance this thing out, we have to start somewhere. I'm gonna start with bromine. I like to start with things that are even. Okay. Bromine's even. I come over here. This bromine is odd. I need to make it even. I make it even by placing a two out there. Two times one is two. That is even. Check my sodium. My sodium is even. My sodium here is odd. I need to make it even. So I put a two there. And now I can go through and erase everything I had that was odd because now everything is even, 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 and that one is balanced. Okay. On to the next one. this reaction, we have cation anion, cation anion. When you have a cation anion, cation anion, you have four players on the field. Four players on the field means the type is double replacement, or DR. Balance this thing out. Let's see here, where am I gonna start? I am gonna start, and you just when you're balancing these, you have to pick an element and you have to play it all the way through and then go to the next element, play it all the way through. Then the next element, play it all the way through. And then you're done, okay? as long as everything's balanced out. So I'm gonna start here because chlorine's even. Chlorine here is odd, but I need to make it even. So I make it even by placing the two there Two times one is two, it's now even. Okay, that's chlorine. To go on to my next top, I'm gonna to go to hydrogen, because my hydrogen here is even, and my hydrogen here is even, okay? I'm gonna check everything out, so I've got one sulfur, one sulfur, one copper, one copper. This one is done, stick a fork in it. Next up, we've got HGO, mercury oxide, chlorine, mercury chloride, and oxygen. Let's take a look at that. First up, let's type it out. Okay. Let's see what we got going on here. Uh, I'm going to track a player. I'm going to track chlorine. I'm going to see what chlorine's doing. It looks like chlorine is coming in here and kicking oxygen out to the curb here. So when a single player comes in and kicks another player out, the key word is single, makes it single replacement. Again, what's going on? Chlorine comes in. It's kicking oxygen out, oxygen goes home alone as the loser. Remember my analogy to the happy couple at the dance in the PowerPoint video. So let's pick an element and go. I'm gonna start with chlorine again because I'm on a roll with chlorine. I'm gonna stay with it. 
I've got chlorine being even. I've got chlorine here being odd. I need to make it even. So I'm gonna stick a two out there and that's gonna make that even. So I can go ahead and get rid of this odd here. Let's see, next, I'm gonna to go to mercury. Mercury here is even. Mercury over here is odd. I need to make it even. To get even, I need to put a two out there and I can erase this odd. Let's see here, oxygen, let's check oxygen. Oxygen here, two times one, that's even. Oxygen here, O2, that is even. And it looks like even, even, even. I know I'm balanced, everything's even. Done, stick a fork in it. All right, let's do the next one. Next one, we've got C plus H2 going to CH4. First up, let's type it. A plus B makes AB synthesis. Again, when you're typing, don't look for the exact match. Look for the best fit. Okay, you've got five families to choose from. Choose the best family. Next, balancing it out. Uh, let's see here, I'm gonna start here because I've got multiples. I've got a four here and a two here, but I need to hit four, four's my mark. To hit four, two times two will give me my four mark. One and one carbon is done. No problems there. That one's balanced. And it's on to the next. Next one, KClO3 to KCl plus O2. Okay, first up, let's type it. It has a single reactant. There's only one family that has a single reactant in it, and that's decomp. So we got that typed. Let's balance this out. I got a three here and a two there on oxygen. I'm gonna go with the three, two scenario. So I've got a three, two. What that means is I'm gonna take that three, bring it there. I'm gonna take that two and put it out front here. And then I'm gonna do my O count. Two times three, remember it's coefficient times subscript. Six, coefficient times subscript. Six. Okay. Then I'm going to take an element. I'm going to go with potassium next. Potassium here is even. Potassium here is odd, but I need to make it even to erase that odd. I need to place a two there. And potassium's done. Now I'm going to check chlorine. Chlorine here. Rid of that six, I don't need it anymore. I know it's even. Chlorine is even, so I'm gonna go over here and check two times one. Chlorine is indeed even. So I have six oxygens, potassium even, chlorine even. I know I'm good, this is done. Next up, S8, sulfur plus fluorine makes sulfur hexafluoride. First up, let's type it. A plus B makes AB, that's going to be textbook synthesis. Okay. So, I'm going to count it out. We've got eight sulfurs here, one there. I've got to fix that number before I go anywhere. Now I've got to fix, I fixed my sulfur problem, but I've created a fluorine problem. 
8 times 6 is 48, so I have 48F on this side, I need 48 on this side. So some number times 2 is going to give me 48, and I like 24. Okay. And that takes care of that one. Stick a fork in it. It is done. All right. On to the last one. BACL2 plus Na2SO4 2 NaCl plus BASO4. Okay. Well, it looks to me, when we're going to type this thing, when a reaction looks very complicated like this one does, it is a double replacement. Cation, anion, cation, anion, this SO4, remember from unit two, that's our old friend, sulfate. So it's going to be a double. And let's go hunting here. I'm going to start with chlorine. Chlorine's been good to me my last three or four tries, so I'm going to stick with it. Chlorine here is even. Chlorine here is odd, but I need to make it even. So to erase that odd, I need a two out there. That makes that even. Let's see, where do I want to go next? I'm going to go to sodium, and it doesn't matter. Could have went to barium or sulfate. When you got polyatomic, do not break it into individual elements. Treat salt, excuse me, treat, treat sulfate as sulfate. Don't break it into sulfur and four oxygens. Uh, you're going to make it way more complicated than you need to do it. So I'm going to go with, I said sodium next. So sodium here is even, and sodium here is even. And I'm going to check my sulfate count. I've got one sulfate here, one sulfate there. I've got one barium here, and I've got one barium here. This reaction is balanced. Okay. And that is it. Uh, that takes care of page 12, which serves as the intro packet. Again, you've got the information from the PowerPoint, the key as far as the family types go. That's on this page. And that should take care of our introductory stuff. Our next hop is going to be page 1, 1 through 15. This page is not keyed because traditionally I've always done this one in class as the second part of my introduction, and that's our next, that's our next hop in this. So we're going to take a look at 1 through 15. These blanks out here are for the type. These little subscripts here, I'm going to move in close. See these little uh, subscripts here, S, G, and S, they don't mean anything other than telling you what state it's in. S is for solid, G is for gas. You're going to run in for AQ, which means aqueous. That means it's in water. Uh, let's see, you might find an L for liquid. That means water again. Uh, so that has nothing to do with our balance. We'll go through, we'll type each reaction, we'll balance it out, and we'll continue on with the Unit 3 packet. Make sure you have a Unit 3 packet. That's our next hop. Okay. Essentially, we're half done with this. We got unit three and unit four to go. So we got a good start in unit three. Let's just keep it rolling. Till next time, stay healthy.